My name is Bruce Meyer. My new book is Testing the Elements, which is a collection of poetry that examines our relationship to the world we live in, how we suffer in it, how we overcome the suffering, and essentially how we respond to the environment and also to the challenges the environment presents us. Beyond the actual four elements, I examine the fifth element, the unspoken element of what lies beyond this world. This poem is from the final section, the fifth element section of the book, and it is titled, The Movie Being Filmed Across the Street from My Hotel Window. We are always somewhere else in our dreams, somewhere in a moment that is not ours. The director motions the figures to marks. The extras are arranged in a raid tableau. I search for allegories in the way they stand, the way the faithful might have been depicted in an illuminated medieval triptych. Their eyes solemn and focused with devotion, a bright light shaping the shadows of their faces. The director charges them with their duties, self-abandonment, the obligation to relinquish their inner lives, to become someone else, someone nameless in a crowd, someone totally unlike themselves. And because we are always somewhere else in our dreams, this is not the city at the end of dreams, because the real New York of concrete and exhaust is hundreds of miles away to the east, and it is warm there on this new spring night. The buds are opening in Central Park, and the New York smell of sea and cigarettes hangs in the air the way trees perfume after a rain has fallen and the street lamps reflect. And the supplicants spread their inner lives on a platter because they are martyrs to the silence of new lives and believe that their rebirth is close at hand. Labor with the intensity of true believers. They are pilgrims who have arrived at a shrine and stand patiently waiting for a miracle to happen, for their eyes to be opened and something wonderful to be named. This is not eternity, but the idea of forever, Life wants everyone to aspire to greatness. The breath of the crowd, the director imagines, is a chronicle of life halted in retelling, still and motionless beneath my window, and the road to stillness is paved in snow. The lights of the NYPD cruisers are flashing beacons of tabernacle lamps, alarming the city of living souls that the dawn will soon invade desires. No place remains for the mind to go, except the street where it has always been, a view from a window on a world asleep, a still life framed by pixelated frame that is not the street but the image of the word. For we are always somewhere else in our dreams, where snowflakes stand in as falling petals to prove what is here and now and is not true is the surety of heaven within ourselves, the loss of the self that must find the self, and know we can reach it if only in our dreams. Mm -hmm.